Hello everyone, this is Anil. Welcome to Education Tath. We are working on Flowable series and from today onwards, we are starting with Flowable Open Source. We will start with overview first and then we will talk about some of the hands-on exercise. So let's be with me. If you remember, we started installation, we downloaded Flowable Open Source Wars and that the version was 6.6.0. We excluded its Wars and installed it using Apache Tomcat. If you have not watched the earlier installation video, I'll put its link on the description as well as you can refer it through the card. And then what we are going to do, we are going to start this. We will create a very simple task the way we did for enterprise version. For that, we just need to start Catalina Bat or I'm just looking for a startup.bat. Yeah, this one. We just need to launch a startup.bat. It open up and launches the Tomcat version, deploys all the VARs that we copied in the Tomcat web apps folder earlier. This will take some time. I'll give it uh, by the time like uh, this launches up and then we'll take you through some of the core components of the offering in open source. So here we can see that the server is starting up and running on 8080 port as we can see no exceptions as such so what it does it has certain queries or the daemon files where it runs on at the start of the process engine or the tomcat launch event and then bases on the underlying production tables and some of the var file deployment this application or the bpm process engine gets up and running let's have a look for that you need to open up the browser and you need to log in with localhost 8080 ui for now i have stopped enterprise services and this is the only service that is up and running so to talk about and give you some comparison an enterprise version we had engage so that is very similar to the task application here then we had design which is very similar to the model application modeler application provided with open source and then we had control flowable control which is very similar to or that functionality is comprised within admin application and idm app Flowable keeps all these functionalities up to date and latest with market needs. With open source, I know some of the organization which are working on enterprise versions, some of the organizations working on open source and open source is also very competitive and they provides all the necessary APIs to make this a very robust product and fit for any organization for any of their workflow related needs so let's have a look what they have in task application in task application since this is vanilla version we have not done any changes so far so you will see all of these tabs are empty to be able to let's quickly start with and uh, do a quick test how the tasks are created in flavorable task application we can simply create a task we can give this as a name complete playable open source we want to give this a description i want to do it asap and then create so as soon as you create the task from this option you will see that the task is created and since the assignee was by default uh, to the self assignee so that's where you will see that assignee is test administrator you can search and assign to some other users as well on due date you can give some due date which is uh, more apt with this task and you can also involve other persons in completing this task you can attach some content or uh, comments and uh, you can even create a subtask so all these options you can see are very well available here 
now the next thing we are not going to do much uh research with this flowable open source source and then session because the idea is to give you a quick highlight how the applications can be up and running and how the task can be created so we can just simply go and complete this task right so this is what we wanted to complete in this session going forward we are going to create a complete application very similar to the way we did in enterprise version for loan application but this time we are going to create this we are going to modify it and then we will be going to deploy it so this was a quick session on flowable introduction though we have not talked about much of other applications or the models within open source that we are definitely going to touch base and discuss that in detail but with this let me know any feedback on the open source or some of the sessions i already talked about happy to share your feedback in comments like comment and subscribe obviously this is a motivation for me and building a good content over the period of time thanks for watching